Hey guys, let's start today's class and uh, today's discussion. And we are going to have some MCQ type of questions today, and we will be practicing Charles Lamb. So, first question is Charles Lamb wrote under the pen name of. And uh, let me tell you. कि आज मैं आप लोगों को सीधे आंसर ही बताऊंगा इसमें मैं आप लोगों के लिए ऑप्शंस रीड नहीं करूंगा आप ऑप्शंस रीड कर सकते हैं खुद से और एक रिक्वेस्ट कि मेरा जो दूसरा चैनल है उसे जाकर सब्सक्राइब जरूर कीजिएगा जो कि मेरी वीडियोस के कमेंट बॉक्स में आपको लिंक मिल जाएगा इस चैनल को आप इंग्लिश लिटरेचर का एक बार जाकर उसे सब्सक्राइब जरूर कीजिएगा क्योंकि इन फ्यूचर मैं उसी में इंग्लिश लिटरेचर की वीडियोस डालने वाला हूं और मैं चाहता हूं कि जो भी मेरे इस चैनल के सब्सक्राइबर हैं उस चैनल को जरूर वॉच करें आप लोगों को जो भी ये मैटर आपको मिलेगा इंग्लिश लिटरेचर का वो उसी चैनल पर मिलेगा एंड वीडियो को लाइक और शेयर करना ना भूलें अगर आपको ये वीडियो पसंद आती है तो सो लेट्स स्टार्ट अगेन चॉल्स लैम रोड अंडर द पेन नेम ऑफ Answer is Elia, who wrote the last Dutch, last essay of Elia in eighteen thirty three. Answer is Charles Lamb, who wrote the essay on the character and genius of Hoggers. Answer is D. Charles Lamb. He has given us the best picture of Landa, Hood, Clark, and many more interpreting writers of his age. This statement is made for which writer? Charles Lamb. Charles Lamb belonged to. romantic age lamb did not marry because answer is b he had to maintain his mad sister and uh, there is one fact about uh, her that she killed her mother it is said that lamb smiled with one eye and wept with other what does it mean that there was a blending of humor and pathos in his essay c who calls lamb one of the best beloved of english authors Answer is B. W. H. Hudson. What is Lamb's John Woodwill? A tragic play. How did Lamb's mother die? I just told you the answer. B. So you can relate this to this six to nine. Lamb started his career as a clerk in East India House. Charles Lamb wrote one of the following plays which is it John Woodwill Which of the following essays of Lamb is the most autobiographical
बैचलर कंप्लेंट अगेंस्ट मैरिड मैन We are not of Alice, nor of the, nor are we children at all. From which essay of Lamb are these lines quoted? ये काफी important है. अगर आप U P L T और P G T T G T के लिए prepare कर रहे हैं. So the answer is A. Dream children. Who called Lamb gentle-hearted Charles? Gentle-hearted Charles. A. Coleridge. Where were Lamb's essays first published serially? Answer is C. In the London Magazine. Marriage by its best title is a monopoly, monopoly and not of the la least indivious sort. This line appears in Poor Relations. Let her first lesson be with sweet Suzanne Winstantly to reverence her sex. This line appears in C. Modern Gallantry What is the name of Italian clerk in the South Sea House? C. Elia So, you will know from here that Elia was a pen name and they took it because the Italian clerk was uh, the name of Elia was also Elia tha. Now next, but in the tete -tete, there is no shuffling. The truth will be out. These lines appear in the old and the new schoolmaster. The old and the new schoolmaster. What wonders will not women's love perform? This line appears in. Poor relations. What is the meaning of the expression opus operatum est in essay the superannuated man? My work is finished. B. Lamb adopted the name of Elia, an Italian person who was A fellow clerk at the South Sea House who wrote a drama John Woodville, Woodville in blank verse. Lamb Lamb was must influenced, much influenced by Milton. Children love to listen to stories about their elders when they were children. This statement appeared in Dream Children. What is the meaning of Stultus Sum? I am a fool. I love a fool as naturally as if I were of kith and kill kin to him. This line appears in All Fool's Day. Lamb's father was a or an clerk to Mr. Samuel Salt. The young man till 30 never feels practically that he is mortal. This line appears in
so 30 30 the young man till 30 never feels practically that he is mortal this line appears in the new year i c lamb's essays of elia appeared in the answer of 31 question you will write down in comment box you will find out the answer of this question and write down in comment box and uh, you can uh, do one practice with this video before i tell you answer you should answer and then uh, try to write down your number how many questions you did correct in comment box and if you really like the video please don't forget to like because it motivates a lot and second thing please do share the video and third thing remember please sub my another channel too because uh, let me remind you again that i will be uploading on that channel and hope that and that will be a full course on my that uh, means history of english literature i will be uploading in parts i am preparing a course so i will be uploading there on that channel not on this channel okay because uh, that will be separate channel for english literature only so please do subscribe that channel too bye bye take care good luck for exams